Hey guys, so I have another haul video for you. This is a haul from the Paper Tray Ink August release. And I just purchased a few items this time around because I know they're gearing up for their Christmas launch and they will have probably quite a few things I want next month available to me. So the first thing I got is this 20 adhesive sheets. Um, it's $6 and I wanted to try making some stickers. Um, with these because I understand that this is pretty good for coloring um, with Copics. So I'm going to try that. Um, hopefully that works out. And then this I got which is the um, white card stock and this is the what do they call it? It's the um, Stamper Select white card stock. So um, you get 40 sheets I believe in here. Yeah, 40 sheets and it's six dollars. That's a great price. Um, I use that for Copic coloring as well. And then the sets that I purchased this time for the release, I purchased this um, U.S. stamp here. It's you can see it here. It's like a doodle stamp, and um, it was five dollars. And there's the set. That's the actual size. It's much bigger than the picture. Um, they do have a coordinating die, but they were out of stock because this came out last month, I believe. Um, so purchased that and then I got this one which is uh, what the doodle tea time it has a coordinating um, die that goes with it and you can see the teacup there so you get the backer and the detail of the teacup and that amazing so here is the actual stamp set and there's steam in there so you can cut the steam out with the die here. Cool, huh? And then the last actual set that I bought um, that's all related is this, um, what do they call this? It's a detail, it's uh, fancy foliage. So this is more of your autumn type of set. I'll show you this because you can see this better. But you could use it obviously because it's happy birthday sending you a hello but you know for maybe an autumn theme thing um, they have dies that go with it two separate um, dies one is a detail die which is this one you can see it cuts the leaves and everything and then this one is actually to coordinate with what's in the set yeah so um, that's what I purchased there and then one more thing this is actually a die set for a Halloween house. Now, again, you guys have seen, if you've seen my video on the little Tilda house that I make, it actually it was a shop. Um, this is called a Tiny Village, I think, or Tiny Town series is what they're calling it. Um, the box um, made that makes the house is a separate die, but this is an add-on die, so it's a Halloween set, but in most of you guys know that I'm not into Halloween. So the reason why I purchased it is for this piece out here. Um, there's little detail pieces in here, but it's this piece out here, which is a porch. Um, so you can add it on to the house. Um, and it makes these little decorative windows and uh, double doors, I believe that's what that is. Um, so that's the reason I bought it. And um, this will be fun add-on for the Tiny Town series. They call this a Spookville die. There's one more um, that they put out this month for um, for Halloween that goes with that kind of coordinates with the set. I believe it was a tr spooky tree and maybe a fence or something like that. I didn't purchase it because I didn't feel that I would use it. Um, so I did just get this um, Spookville die. So that is my order from Paper Tray Ink. For the month of August and I will be back with another video because I think I have some other orders in, coming in and I'm going to just string them along in this one video. Thanks for watching guys. Talk to you soon. Bye!